Hello again, it's Lock Noob, and this is a story about, well, it's about a bit of a failure, but one which I'm not actually ashamed of. So, um, you may or may not know that I am a, uh, well, I don't work as one anymore, but I'm a scientist, and, um, and I've just been thinking about kind of different pick profiles, and I was trying to aim for a profile which um, had sort of a high peak in the middle um, and low peaks either side just because you know the king and the queen and uh, all those other types of picks that are out there uh, they they do have you know a high peak at either end or in a low peak but nothing really in the middle I thought you know what there's maybe a little gap there then I started thinking about what what sort of natural waveforms are there and I remember um, the, well, the ECG or the EKG, uh, and you have the, um, obviously the, the P wave, Q, R, S, and T wave. Um, I didn't put the small U wave on there. And I just thought, you know, that, that's sort of reminiscent of my, my background and will that kind of be a cool pick? So yeah, I, I, I put the effort in. I, um, I, I made the design in a vector program to see how it would work, whether I could get the peak down to about four millimeters. And um, then I, I, I did a hand sort of grinding and filing and finishing job with, um, uh, if it looks so shiny, it's because it's been finished with two and a half thousand grit um, uh, wet and dry paper, even put a nice handle on it. And actually, I'll be honest, I'm pretty proud of the, um, the craftsmanship there um, just because I did it for me quite a fine job um, using uh, I don't mean fine as in good I mean fine as in you know fine precision work um, I, I'm not that, not that egotistical um, but I did quite a you know a fine job there using some very hard 301 cold rolled steel and I, I put my uh, 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 handles on as well which are made out of 30 millimeter cable ties uh, honestly they're, they're so good if you never tried it try it there's such a nice comfortable handle very light uh, and this is like full tang as well uh, so yeah uh, it works out in some ways artistically just perfectly but this is an example of where let's be honest the um, art the design completely um, outshines the practicality what I didn't really, well, I did consider it, but I thought I'd get away with it, is um, a canyoning effect. So if you notice that the the peak here in the middle, the um, the S uh, peak, which is already shortened considerably to a normal um, EKG or ECG, uh, is, you know, I tried to shorten it a lot while still giving that kind of like classic, well, let's, let's call it the heartbeat motif. Um, but it's still, well, it's, it's, it's a problem. You know, uh, you can get it past the pin, you can pull it back, but I'm just so terrified um, that even with 25 thousandths uh, through one max yield steel, uh, that um, it's just gonna get trapped behind a pin and it'll never come out again. Um, using it this way up, you get a cannoning uh, problem here and here as well. And you know what, even though I tried to make this peak uh, around four millimeters, it's still, even with a wide open keyway like this, it's just too big to get tension on and use. It's completely impractical. Um, but there are some good things. One, I've got a really cool looking pick. And you know what, S sometimes that does mean something. Two, I learned a lot, as I always do, making this thing. And three, if you don't make it, if you don't try it out, if you don't give it a go, you'll never know. You can guess, sure, but try it out. You know, I lost a couple of hours on this, but I don't but I don't really feel I've lost anything. I think this is really cool. I really like this. I will still show this off to people, even though, as a lock pick, it's useless. I mean, it really is useless. I'm sure there's a wafer lock somewhere, wide open kind of wafer lock that this will open, but you know, this, this isn't, this isn't a, a good pick. It just isn't. Uh, I'd love it to be, but it's not. Um, but you know what? I still really, 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 really like it. Um, and yeah, I had such fun making it. So I hope you, I hope you can appreciate the sort of effort that went into this. And I hope that you take away 
um, that sometimes you've just got to try things out and you can't be disappointed if they don't work as long as you did the best job you can do and you gave it a good shot and you thought about it well if it doesn't work out there's no harm done at least you can make a YouTube video of it right <laughs> all right I'll see you next time